I want to go to a place where there's people from the whole world, where everyone is there and I can meet people and make links globally. And so I looked at international schools and I found EF. I like to study everything. I don't want to only study three or four subjects. I want to study a huge range of things. And so as soon as I found out I could do IB as well, it became a lot more appealing. Things like my Spanish class, there is seven of us. <laughs> and we just, it's like a tiny little family and we all discuss and we know the teacher really well. He knows when you're not okay and when you are okay. Um, and that's really nice. And my music class is exactly the same. We are, it's one of my favorite classes to go to. And it's like, you make such good connections with people because you live with them. They see you when you're crying. They see you when you're happy. They see you when you're angry. They see you like in every single shade and you see them in the same way. And so you have like deeper connections with people than you would normally because you're just doing everything all the time together. And you don't have to do it that way, the way I like to do it as that way, because especially in a boarding school, when you're here alone, away from your family, I think it's important that you find family and your friends. One of the things we have in the school is the culture fair. And that's a huge opportunity to tell everyone about your culture. It's very based on food, because <laughs> that's what gets people in the rooms. But you, you get to actually like teach people about your culture, and I get to wear my Welsh jersey, and being the only one here. It's really important to me to represent my own culture as important as it is to learn about the others because it's not so often in your own home country that you get to do that because you're surrounded by people who come from there so you have no need to represent. When you're here you are the country embodied in a person so you have to try and teach other people about that. One of the memories that I definitely treasure the most was within coming back within the first few weeks we were sitting on a Friday evening and we didn't go out and we all sat, there was like a group of us, we all sat in one of the lounges and me and my friend both play ukulele and so we started playing ukulele and everybody started singing and so there was like a whole group of us just sitting in a circle in this lounge all singing, it was like a real family moment when you look around you, you think, I'm going to miss these people so much when they don't live three doors down from me, when they don't live, you know, the corridor up think like what is life going to be like when well, we can't do this anymore because we're all spread across the world and it is sad but it was such a beautiful moment. <laughs>